Hello, hello, hello. I'm going to talk at you right now about the Wi-Fi's. More specifically, how the Wi-Fi gets from this little box to my device or computer. And what kind of things go on in that signal's journey from that box to this box. Okay, so here I have my wireless router, my laptop, and my mobile device. What I'm going to do is scan the Wi-Fi radio frequency spectrum to check to see what channels are open and clear so that I can set my router for one of those channels and have less RF interference. So let's open up the Wi-Fi scanning software. It'll take a minute to scan all of the channels and get a good read on what's in the environment. Now, as we can see, we have a bunch of Wi-Fi networks around here. Okay, now that we have our spectrum analysis software up, we're going to take a look at a couple things that we want to make sure we notate when we're looking at this. Some of the things that are important on here. The network name, the SSID that's being broadcast, it's going to tell me what that is right here. What type of device that is broadcasting that SSID? Uh, it gives us a manufacturer name. We can kind of hunt it down if we need to. The signal strength. This is going to be really important when we start looking at those things that are maybe interfering with our signal. The channel that it's on. Again, very important. When we're trying to set our device on its own channel, we want to make sure we take note of these channels and what our device is on and see if anything in there is going to interfere with that. The width of that channel. Down here, you can see channels have a specific width. Now, is that width going to be 20 megahertz, 40 megahertz, or 80 megahertz? The band of that channel. What type of channel band is it doing? 2.4 gig or a 5 gig? 2.4 goes through walls and obstructions a lot better than 5, but 5 has a much faster speed. What's our max throughput rate? How many megabits per second are we going to get from that Wi-Fi? Now, as I can see here, the wireless SSID, the wireless network that I want to be on, is on the same channel as a bunch of other networks. So, I'm going to go back and see how I can switch my router's channel and maybe get a little bit more open spectrum so my devices will work much better. Okay. So now we've taken a look at the Wi-Fi spectrum and we see a bunch of interference, the noise of other networks and Wi-Fi transmitting devices. So now, how do I make sure my network is not obstructed by those other Wi-Fi's? Let's go into the router and find an open channel. What I need to do is find on my particular router's interface where the channel selection is located. I need to open up my router's user interface and find the channel selection here. Now, I look at my Wi-Fi scanning software and find an open channel. Now, I set my router for that open channel I just found. And now, I need to reboot my router. And now, I check the router to make sure the settings took. And now, I can check my scanning software to show that the RF is on a clean channel. Now, my wireless router is set up to broadcast its RF signal on a channel that is free from noise and other competing channels. And my laptop 
and devices will be able to perform well.